I would like to draw the attention of Mr. President that Nigeria is not a one-party country. Yes. You cannot begin to intimidate every other yes. political party. And INEC is not an addendum, an extension of the presidency and APC. I'm an SDP and I will not allow myself and my followers to be disenfranchised. And if you look at Kogi State today, it's quite unfortunate that we have all the agencies and institutions that are sadly with the responsibility of ensuring good governance are silent and watching Yahya Bello become an emperor. Yes. It's unfortunate. The yes. people are suffering, the economy is depleted, there's the hopelessness everywhere. People are committing suicide. Yes. And here we are forming a coalition of good, willing, good, well-meaning Kogites trying to come together to see how we can salvage our, our state and what we are facing today is intimidation from the federal government and from its agencies. We are not going to, I'm going to stay here with my people yes. until we actually are sure that we are going to play the ballot. And we'd like to tell Yaya Bello that he, his doom is near yes. because he is going to lose that election. There's a movement looming. We are going to liberate Kogi State. Myself, we're going to form an alliance with other political parties yes. and I tell you oh, yes. a new Kogi State is possible. Come November 16, 2019. Thank you so much.